Beekeepers play a crucial role in the production of agriculture. Commercial beekeepers tend to be semi-nomadic, often driving long distances to service clients' crops. Several common migration routes include California, which is an estimated 90% of all U.S. commercial hives, and as far away as Florida and Texas. At the end of the pollination season, some beekeepers move their colonies north, while others depart for southern and eastern U.S. locations. Hives are typically returned to southern states during the winter. Apiculture Insurance, or API for short, is a federally subsidized crop insurance program. API has been available in limited parts of the country since 2009 and is designed to cover the unique precipitation requirements of different regions across the nation. On July 27, 2017, RMA expanded the API program to the 48 contiguous states providing increased support for this essential component of agriculture. Providing risk management to beekeepers is important to Sylvius. We are proud to do our part in helping beekeepers protect their business. During dry periods, nectar production decreases and the overall health of the hive declines. API is an area of risk protection for lack of rainfall. Most beekeepers consider apiculture insurance as a feed replacement program for their hives. You can purchase as high as 90% of a 70-year average rainfall. Deductibles range between 10 to 30%. It is not, however, an individual rain guarantee on the exact location of your colonies. Let's look at how this program works. Each little red dot on the map represents a NOAA-approved weather station. There are over 9,000 weather stations with more and more stations being added each year. It's impractical to monitor all rainfall in every location but can be done very well when monitoring precipitation over a general area. RMA assigns a base dollar amount of protection per colony for the county. Each state varies. If RMA sets a colony value of, let's say, $75.03 per colony, they will let you buy up to 150% or $112.55 per colony, or buy as little as 60% of that which is $45.02 per colony value. After your coverage level, ranging from 70% to 90% is applied, you arrive at your dollars of coverage per colony. The base amount is fixed and set by the RMA, but you have a lot of flexibility to purchase a coverage amount that fits your operation. The rainfall index is all based on a grid system. The grid lines run on longitude and latitude lines, and each grid is a quarter point longitude by a quarter point latitude, roughly a 12 by 17 mile grid depending on where you are in the country. This is why it's referred to as an area risk policy. It is insuring for a lack of rain on any colonies you have that fall within that 12 by 17 mile grid. Now that you understand the basic ideas behind the program, let's look at how the program works. Each areas have two month intervals starting in January and ending in December. The coverage is spread out throughout the year by choosing intervals and then coverage level. For example, January and February is one interval. Generally, you can put at least 10% coverage per two month interval if you choose to use it, and at most 70%. The maximum coverage in an interval ranges between 50% and 70% depending on the county. It can sound a little complicated, but with Sylvia's agents, you will get recommendations not available with any other agent. We built software called RangeCalc, which combines interval information with NOAA rainfall data being used for the API program. These calculations will show how to best use the program based on percentage of payment and net returns. So what the software is doing for you is taking these two month intervals and finding where the volatility lies. Sylvia's agents will analyze all of your grids to best optimize your insurance plan, keeping your costs down and coverage up. Combined with a good understanding of your operation, we will provide a thorough recommendation for you. In addition to providing solid advice, 
Sylvia's agents have access to a proprietary rainfall index lookup tool. The rainfall lookup tool estimates interval results within four days after an interval ends. The RMA typically releases actual rainfall results 60 days after an interval ends. Sylvia's customers receive actual rainfall results much earlier than non-Sylvia's customers, allowing them to plan more effectively knowing if they will receive a lost payment or not. API requires you to sign up by December of this year for the following year's coverage of January through December. A nice benefit is that the premiums are not due until the end of September next year. No money up front. In fact, it is possible for the policy to trigger loss payments early in the year which fund the premium, meaning less or no premium payments due by September. Any losses over and above the policy premium are paid directly to the policyholder without any adjuster involvement. non sylvius agents don't have the tools to analyze all the grids available to you, including the grids where your bees move to and work in. Therefore, they're unable to prepare a complete study and recommendation for all your options. For example, we recently came across an operation with API coverage in Calusa County, California. Rainfall Index Grid 22831. Their non sylvius agent put even coverage in three intervals and the producer did not fully understand his policy. After visiting with the sylvius agent, the producer understood his API policy better and changed his coverage levels to increase his profitability by $8.64 per colony. There's no reason to gamble on the weather anymore. Let a Sylvius agent prepare a custom recommendation for you. Let us show you how API can help you cover your hive.